Hello everybody, my name is Ankisha Gupta and I'm a student at Learning Alias. Today I'll be showing you the basics of rendering your alias models in Keyshot 5. Some settings to consider when importing your file is that you want to know how to navigate in the viewport of Keyshot 5. Using the left mouse button, you can click and drag to rotate around your object. Use the scroll wheel to zoom in or out and click in the middle mouse button to pan. Under the material tab in the project window, I can click on the material I've just applied, right click, edit material, and I get a multitude of different options that I can change. I can change the base code window. Here you'll find various different preloaded environment maps. These are called HDRIs and you can download many of these just using a simple Google search. I'm going to try changing it to this environment. Use the arrows to move your model in its corresponding direction and use the cubes to scale your model. To accept the changes, click the green check mark or to discard them, click the red X. Another very useful feature in Keyshot 5 is the ability to create new camera installations as you can see. This can be particularly useful for people with underpowered CPUs that just want to set up their scene, assign their materials, find the angle of the final bring out your model. 